Hey everybody, welcome back to the LAN portal. In this video, I'm gonna go over how to use the single skip trace button function in the LAN portal, how to use it, what are the use cases where it can be valuable. So what I'm gonna do, I'm just gonna zoom in on, you can do this anywhere in the country, I'm just gonna zoom in on a random area around Atlanta, Georgia. And what we're gonna do, we're just gonna find a parcel, two parcels, and I'm gonna show you how this works. So as you scroll in, you're gonna see the parcel boundaries show up and let's say you want to get someone's number like let's say for example you're buying properties in this neighborhood and maybe you sent mail to the neighborhood you've had good success and you want to make some cold calls like you just you just want to get on the phone make some cold calls you don't feel like pulling all the data and you just want to make a few cold calls see if there's other interest obviously a lot of these aren't vacant land but this is just examples of what you can do with this function so what you can do here you can click into the parcel we're going to have all the parcel information pop up so you can see 0.27 acres building square the building size everything like that but what we want to look at is this skip trace function up here and what you're going to do it's like it's we said it's a one button skip trace you can name the property if you want to name it something else you can also have it export into something um, this is what is getting put into the skip trace function and you're going to hit place order and it is really really as simple as that there's not much more that goes to it what is going to pop up is the owner's phone number so phone number one phone number two and then the nice thing about this function is when you go back into this parcel you're going to see that it is going to have a new tab called skip trace information and it's going to have this phone number phone number one phone number two in here you can see as we go to different parcels that we have not skip trace like this one that is not in here so any parcels that you have skip trace or skip trace in the past, it's going to keep this information in your profile. So again, we go here and then you also, if you want more information on them. So if you want the full skip trace information, you can download straight here from CSV. Then you'll see here on the CSV, you're going to have all the information. So not just phone number one, phone number two, like we saw in the land portal, you're going to see email, you're going to see phone number three, you're going to see relatives and much deeper information. What we have seen the most value for people using the land portal single skip trace function is when they get a deal and then they call neighboring parcels. So they get a deal in an area, they really like the area, they see some vacant parcels in the area, then they start cold calling these five, 10 people. And we have seen this great success rate with this strategy in adding deals to your portfolio. Other than that, thank you so much. We'll see you next time.